I'm hoping they give me a job. I mean, this is a sensational, sensational work. So the plan today is to go to Babylon's Turin, which is a wine farm where you can do lots of activities surrounded by beautiful mountains. It's also home to Babel, which is one of the best restaurants in Cape Town, and that says a lot. One of these years it had one of the best restaurants in the world. We're just going to say the world's best restaurant. Yeah, just in general, the food here is amazing yeah. and really cheap compared to Montreal and anywhere. scissors, I chose to go get the coffee while Dave does the dishes. So I'm going to our favorite coffee shop, it's called Lecker, and we always get oat milk cappuccinos. So let's go. Woohoo, blue skies! But I'm not gonna get my hopes up too high just yet because Cape Town weather changes like that. Just got back and like I said, no more blue skies. Except for that little patch. Come on little patch. If I could take you back to it's like camping. It actually comes out really nice. My will is strong with a place to lean. In the moment I hung this bill. Here we go! There are so many good views on this drive. You're gonna love it. So I tried my very best, um, but a real pro had to take over. <laughs> okay, so right now the sky is pretty much split down the middle. Cloudy on this side, blue skies on that side. Where is Babylon's tourist? <laughs> that way. Well, 10 minutes ago it was blue on that side, cloudy on that side, so things can change. Just a hard day's work out We're gonna go on a bike ride now. Um, they gave you boots, so. Tell them what happened with the weather. It's not sunny, it's sunny and warm, so we wanna make the most of it. Okay, we have a leader. You're the leader. So we've made it to Babylon's Turin. It is super windy, but we actually have blue skies now, so lucky us. Normally, you'd be going in for a wine tasting before dinner, but alcohol sales are banned in South Africa at the moment because of lockdown. Chloe doing Chloe things over there. 
right, should we continue biking? Hold on. We just spotted a crocodile. No, Legavon. <laughs> a Legavon. Kind of looks like a crocodile. Correction, it's like a big iguana. I could take you back to my youth and show you what I wish I knew. My will is strong with a place to lean. In the moment I hung best belief, the other ring of my wrist is gold. Pairing with the light it holds. When I return from my skin and bone, what's in there? I think that's honey. So romantic. So romantic. So, do you know what these are? What? Peach pips. No Peach way. Pips. Yeah. Every single one. What's the story behind this? What the blue and white? Yeah. It's done for me because I like blue and white. Back where I belong. I want it all. I had a feeling, but the feeling is all gone. Bugs that eat bugs live here. Their natural peace, nature's peace. You obviously have the stick sweet up here. Pinecone like village, the old <laughs> acre. We got the bark sweets up here. This is where the moths and stuff like to live. We got some combination sweets over here. So um, if I'm on like a medium budget, where would I get put? Oh, uh, right down there. It's fancy. Oh, man. It's fancy up in here. <laughs> Dave just went off on a bike ride and I came across this really cool greenhouse structure with tons of plants. Who knew Chloe was so interested in cacti? Where are you? Wave. Aren't we going to we're eating everything that we're eating is from this garden. Wow, this makes my ears look funny. <laughs> that one didn't give no claps. <laughs> and well, quite frankly, these guys don't give a duck. This is where we're sleeping tonight. It's the most This is the deluxe cabin. Very expensive. Behind us are the beautiful um, wine farms that we can't try. But look how beautiful they are. Look how tasty they look. Look how subtle <laughs> hints of oaky they look. Look how velvety and how fruity and how... Barren. Barren. Barren? Yeah, they're not... They're like not blooming. I should be the last to know We're all in this I stand Show me you Love. Are you ready to go get chicken eggs? <laughs> I'm really tired, but it's gonna be worth it. It's gonna be worth it. How are you feeling? Are you tired? I'm too excited to be tired. Time to collect our breakfast. Wake up call. So we woke up early this morning to partake in a chicken walk. Chicken walk, yeah. Chicken slash donkey walk. This is normally for the kids. Get to go and pick our own eggs for breakfast. <laughs> Sounds awesome. I think that's kind of cool. How many people have picked their own eggs for breakfast? And you get to a pet the donkeys. <laughs> okay, well, not these people. To get back the life I I'm <laughs> <laughs>
So we just finished collecting eggs. It's a little, a little uneventful. I just didn't realize that chickens laid all their eggs in a perfect circle on a shelf <laughs> inside of a barn. No, it turns out this really was for kids. All right, now Dave has to go and hand our uh, collection to the chef. Show them what you got. Oh, wow. I'm hoping they give me a job. I mean, this is a sensational, <laughs> sensational work. I mean, I don't think anyone's collected this many eggs before. Not, not the eight-year-olds that were here the other day? No, no, they've got tiny little hands. We've got our big grown-up <laughs> hands. We can get many eggs. <laughs> okay, show, show them what you got. So, this is Babel. The usual struggle for hand sanitizer. Chloe couldn't decide. decide which meal. Get this both. Is huge. Off to another dinner at Babel. Yeah, we're fortunate enough to get to go two nights in a row. Yeah, last night we kind of overate. We all ordered like two meals because we were so hungry. And then there was giant starter plus the two meals each. So we learned our lesson. Yeah, we're going in much more tactical tonight. It's our last day here at Babylon's Torrent. Been here for three days. Um, so we're just gonna go grab some breakfast, then maybe wander in the gardens a bit more and then head home. I didn't get the eggs, you got the eggs. <laughs> Chloe, Chloe got these eggs that the chef made into our delicious omelette. 